everybody. So um, I am pregnant. I am so excited. Um, I did not think that I would be pregnant now. Um, a lot of things leading up to it just made me, um, you know, the whole TTC thing, you know, I'll make a second video about that, but um, I wasn't having cycles and all of this stuff and I was starting fertility treatments and um, and then I got pregnant. So um, that's amazing. I'm so excited. Um, so we found out on December 25th in the morning, um, before we opened presents or anything like that, um, Caroline got up, um, well, like 7.15 or something, maybe 6.45 and wanted some juice. She's had a cough and so we've been giving her pineapple juice, which helps dissipate all the, you know, break up all the phlegm and stuff. So I got her some juice and I was like, I think I should test. And the day before I started spotting, and so I was just like, oh, well, my period's coming. Um, and so it didn't really make sense for me to take a test, but I did. And I took a test, and I waited, and I looked at it, and nothing came up. So I was like, whatever, I wanted to go back to bed. So I put on the candle in the bathroom where I always put my tests. And maybe an hour or so later, when the kids woke up to open gifts, I came in the bathroom to like pull my hair back and brush my teeth before we opened gifts and I looked at the test and there was a line on it and so I was like well that has to be an evap line so I took another one and I waited and waited and waited and I have like the internet cheapies those like one flow ones and you have to, it says you have to wait five minutes it didn't take that long for my line to come up but I had to wait a long time it felt and you know kids are knocking on the door my husband was knocking on the door they're like what is going on? Come on, let's go. And, um, ever since I had Caroline, like I just wanted to find a super fun way to tell my husband. I wanted to tell him a fun way when I found out when I was pregnant with Caroline, but I just, I didn't have time, like enough to think of anything. Um, so I, I told him right away, but ever since I had her, I've been looking up different ways, just fun ways, like to tell your, your significant other that, um, you're pregnant. And I just never found anything that was really, I felt like fit us or that would work good for us. Um, so he was knocking on the door and finally I opened the door and I was like, just wait a minute. And he's like, what's, what are you doing in there? And I said, nothing. And I closed the door and then I thought for a moment, I was like, okay, whatever. And so I pulled him in here in the bathroom and, um, I was like, look, he's like, what am I looking for? You know, true guy fashion. Um, and I was like, there's two lines there. And he's like, and I'm like, that means I'm pregnant. And he's like, really? And so we were really, really excited, of course. And, um, you know, he knew that I had been startling with this and that we had decided to get pregnant. And anyway, so it was a total blessing. And it was so exciting that it was Christmas morning. It made everything so much better. And so, yeah, that's how we found out. Um, and so I don't know if you guys knew, uh, I remember from last time, but I was pregnant with my oldest sister, um, I'm the youngest of, of four, but, um, I was pregnant with my oldest sister last time. She was due two weeks after I was, and her son was actually born like three weeks before Caroline. Um, but she's actually pregnant. We're actually pregnant at the same time again this time. She is five weeks ahead of me. So yeah, that's very exciting. And she's been trying for a really long time. So, um, so that's really exciting that we're pregnant again together. Um, and yeah, um, we told Caroline, we didn't tell her right away because my husband wanted just to keep it between him and I on Christmas day. And I was kind of like, whatever. I'm one of those people who needs to share, you know, and that's how like my excitement is like multiplied by sharing with people. And he's one of those people who likes to keep things a secret between us. And it's more exciting for him that way, just because that's our special secret and whatever. That's how he works. That is totally not how I work. But so we kept it to ourselves for Christmas day. And then the following day I was like, how long do we have to wait to tell anybody? He's like, you can tell people today. So I told my mom and my dad, actually I didn't tell my dad, my niece just spilled the beans to my dad. Um, and some aunts and cousins were here and not all my sisters were though. So I told another one of my sisters today. I still have one more sister to tell. Um, I'll see her in a few days. Um, and we told Caroline, oh my goodness, it's so cute. I took a clip of it. So, um, I will post that separately, just her reaction. So that was just so precious. So she is so very excited. She, every day she's like, where's the baby? Is the baby crying? Can I hold the baby? Um, so she's very, very excited. 
Um, and we actually have not told William yet because he he left, he went to go to his mom's right after Christmas. And so uh, we wanted to, we didn't want to tell him like right before he ran out the door type thing. So we'll be telling him in a few days. And um, yeah, so we are really, really excited. I have yet to tell my best friend because she's sick. She's pregnant. Um, so I'm going to wait to tell her in person. But yeah, so I'm very, very excited. And um, so just so you guys know, these videos are going to be posted after I tell everybody so that everyone knows um, because my family are all subscribed to the vlog. Um, and so I wanted to be able to tell everybody personally before they see on the internet. So um, these are just going to be posted probably, probably not even that much later, maybe a week max two. Um, but I'm definitely keeping up on the weekly vlogs and stuff like that. So anyway, I'm so excited to do this journey with you guys again and yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye.